Warp yarns used in indigo denim fabrics must go through numerous processing steps before they're ready to be woven. These processing steps are unique to indigo denim fabric manufacturing. Most often, the warp yarns are indigo dyed on a system referred to as a long chain or rope range. For this system, multiple ends of yarn are formed into a rope or ball warp, then continuously dyed. After dyeing, the dyed ball warp is rebeamed into individual yarns evenly spaced onto beams called section beams. These beams are then slashed and then woven. If the warp yarns are to be slasher or sheet dyed, then the yarns will be warped onto section beams and indigo dyed. In most cases, the yarns will also be slashed or sized in the same process. The yarn is then woven. If the warp yarns are to be beam dyed, then the yarns are warped onto perforated dye beams for dyeing instead of being formed into ropes. After beam dyeing, the dyed yarn is then slashed and woven. If it is chosen to have natural warp yarns, then prior to weaving, these yarns will be warped onto section beams, then slashed and woven. The fabric is then processed in a normal manner. This would include desizing, preparation, dyeing if desired, and finishing. Unlike the warp yarn, most filling yarn is put onto yarn packages and delivered directly to the weaving machine where it's inserted into the fabric without any wet processing. But sometimes dyed filling yarns are used to achieve a different looking denim.